Hi guys, shall we look at a new desktop that Arch Linux provides? So let's um, use the Arch Linux ISO of um, 2025 06 01 June and then um, just boot up regularly, no update. I'd like to have the latest Arch installed, it's something else. First of all, I'm gonna go for my keys. I can make this a little bit bigger, I always forget. Set font tur minus V18 N I think. Yeah, a little bit better. Not that much better, but okay, right? Zoom in and then you'll get you can read it. Now the thing is there is a new version of Arch install. So I'll just do quickly first minus SY arch install. So I get the new database in, get the new package in. Yes. To really be sure that what I want to do is the very best code there is today, right? And there is a new choice to be made. So the localis don't change. There's nothing changing here for me. Um, let's go for keyboard layout, right? Like that. BE, Latin, all the rest is the same. Still loving Sweden so much. Okay, this configuration, all good. X4 back swap, don't want it. Root password. and this is what's new so we can choose awesome that's not new right many things were there already you choose and use your own code like hyperland it's gonna be providing something I hope and i3 as well so this is new this is new I believe and I think river is new as well I want to like uh, have a look at this um, lab WC See what it is, polkit seat. I'm gonna take polkit and then stop them. Well, the rest is um, up to us. So let's have a look at the packages. So not much really, but I have a lot so that's cool. Graphics drivers were on virtual machine. Don't need to do anything here. And in greeter, I definitely want to have SEDM. Audio, choose whatever you like, network, this one, parallel downloads. I'm gonna go for 30 here and still Brussels. Install, yes. And that's it, right? Arch install is a great tool when it works and it's always with scripts, right? Small things can happen. Things that um, are not, well, how do you say that? External influences, right? That. Um, nothing to do with the script as such can make wreak havoc as they say anyway let's see what this lab WCS maybe we should have a look already and find out lab WC because it's if it's valent I'm not so much interested <laughs> and it is right what is this? Stands for Lab Wayland Compositor, where Lab can mean any of the following lightweight and box inspired, inspired by inspiration, buns and laps and arch laps. Yes. All right. But it is a WL roots based window stacking compositor for Wayland. Means for me, uh, virtual box, probably not going to be working but let's see so have a look at this like i've said maybe in some videos and certainly on some comments as a user i'm not really interested in wayland anymore and sticking to chat wm but right doesn't mean we can't be curious and see what we get. And if we get something on a virtual machine, 
maybe we need to change some configurations there in order for it to work maybe it can work on QMU which is an alternative uh, that you can use it's it's already finished just wanted to show you the vert manager or not even installed it right so QMU is a possibility for you as well I'm sticking to VirtualBox reboot is this überhaupt gonna work <laughs> first of all we need to get rid of the machine the the iso here so he can boot up from the hard disk and now the question is will we see something As it greets us, doesn't mean we're in, right? Doesn't mean we're in at all. This is the beautiful lab WC. We have reconfigure, we have something already. But then it's looking up how does this work? What configuration does it need? Do I need to do something? what should i do is there anything a wiki that can be helpful arch links okay uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. okay but where is the configuration it seems to work but then right this is all about installing where is the configuration is there a dot config somewhere All right, configuration three. Getting started. I guess we need to get these guys. If not, you can download them here. What do we have? Can I have a look at the contents? So, right control, F3. Then log in. Where am I? I'm here. That's not found, okay cd.config or is there no dot config ls present working directory is eric ls gives us this ls minus al gives us that there is no dot config right so no files nothing of any kind me personally i think um i would install xfc or something right so i have something graphical and i can look up in the virtual machine what i should do and then go copy paste code inside out because this does not work right does not work at all so a pseudo pacman minus s xfc4 and maybe xfc4 goodies will help me get to a graphical environment read a lot copy a lot w get some stuff because i needed to copy paste these guys make a directory and go grab these guys so i put this i would put this into a script then of course you have something right but then it's up to you to change that something environment how to start menu rc so here's how to get started getting started manual more integration read me home have a look at that code i'm not gonna do it as you figured that one out already <laughs> but we need some things right but i'm gonna do a little bit uh no not what i want let's do a reboot 
just want to get the wget thing there and that's it and there no package or anything for me at all playing around see if i can get this a little bit better would be great if we could type something so let's see if we can this would be better right now firefox let's get that in come to papa right okay and now we go to love wc internet firefox lab wc i think that was on github yeah cancel and accept everything and go here there was a wiki and in the wiki we wanted to no that was not a wiki yes no it was here and then the configuration and there were some themes actually theme example we're not ready for themes yet getting started configuration and this is it right control a blue not working this is what we need to do copy no minimize let's see Huh. Okay. Uh, let's open the document, start or something. Control V. And the shebang thing. How is it written again? The, the shebang thing. It's in all our scripts, right? But. this one that one bin bash safe okay looking good and then we run it can we run it already no so properties permissions execute as an application right mouse click start Voila, that's done. What we have is now .config labwc. We have an auto start. So wait, we should add, we should add some applications. So there are things in here that we don't have. We don't have Waybar. We don't have this. We don't have that. It's a lot of things in here. Environments. We could our, get our Bipata cursors. Here's a menu minimize maximize workspaces left here's a web browser execute firefox good choice our gritty yeah reconfigure so there is our menu that we need to change and the rc xml is the radius corners w return right mouse click okay so this is what we get by default um if i want to see something probably need to install a bit more pseudo pacman minus s waybar for instance and she's there so way background is there what else waybar mako is there as well mako and sway idle Lots of stuff. We log out, and we have already always a, a graphical user interface. So whatever is going wrong, or whatever Tyler Window Manager want to focus on, right? We always have something, a desktop. That's a custom menu, web browser, terminal, reconfigure, exit, power off. Right, reconfigure, custom menu, web browser, 
is opening Firefox that's cool this is a button that we should look into what is this button doing you need to install fonts to make this work right and some some icons that you need to fix this does something I'll sway idle probably anyway um, power off for me but this is sway and um, sorry not sway but this is uh, oh my god this is lap WC that was it lap WC so have a look if uh, Wayland is your thing you still need a lot of work to do and I will be not be doing the work right so you're sure about that you don't have to ask me it's up to you to make a config that works and there were themings as well I saw some weird themes so have a look at that and see what you can do with the themes department there all right cheers